Tennessee. He'll come out throwing on first down. Wide open downfield. Open runway ahead. He's at the 10. Touchdown, Husky. Let's do it, baby. Let's and do once it. he found open Let's space, do it. the fan might as well start playing. They can what's going on out there youtube what's up team hollywood and what's up my college football 25 fans it's your man hollywood sports if you are new to my channel thank you for clicking on this video and welcome guys welcome to hollywood sports uh what i want to talk about in this play guys i was just basically playing exhibition play now mode just practicing i um, trying to learn my offense looking for keys on the offense when to notice mismatch or notice clues to take advantage of the defense and one thing I didn't see when I was running this play I saw it when I looked at the replay is that you see these corners are playing pretty tight right here okay they're playing pretty tight okay normally I normally look at that if they're playing on the inside I normally look at that but I didn't pay attention because I knew this guy's gonna be coming across miles uh, uh, Jacks Giles Jackson and then my tight end was gonna be coming across here and I was gonna hit one of them okay but I was I forgot about the presses to pay attention to the presses let's see what happens on this play we're gonna play the speed and then we're gonna break it down you see where I went with the football right here right and it actually worked out we take it to the house okay but that's not what it what it's really all about. We got speed. Gauss Jackson got a lot of speed. But what I noticed was, watch, watch him. Watch how he plays this. He's gonna jam him up. They do a pretty good, um, they do a pretty good job jamming up the receivers right here. I like that. I really like that. But let's see uh, what ha what was the result. What I should have been looking at on this play. Okay, look at the right side. We got Boston. Uh, 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 one of our outs, uh, uh, one of our wide receivers, Boston on the right side. Watch this. We're gonna break it down. Okay, he gets jammed up right here. Okay, now he's got a, he's got the advantage right here. He's got a step over him right here. If I had saw that man, that could have been a touchdown. If I had thrown it just right, I don't know if he would have made up the ground. But I gotta pay attention to that. Whenever they jam your receivers up, you gotta pay attention to that. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna make sure I do that next time. Let's look at the left side and see what happens. He had no advantage on the left side. And plus, the safety, the safety right here was helping him out immediately. Watch this. The safety is going to go over there and, and, and get him. Okay, now, look at the safety on the other side. Look at this safety right here. Watch what he does on this play. Okay, he doesn't help out deep. He goes towards the middle of the field. And I had that one-on-one -on -one coverage right here. See, this, this helps me in practice, guys. When I see uh, uh, like a bump and run coverage or, uh, uh, you know, a press coverage, I got to know to look for those, okay? Because I believe this would have been a touchdown, even though we got the touchdown anyway from Giles Jackson coming across the middle. All right, guys. This is how I do practice. Uh, uh, instead of going to practice mode, I like to do it live sometime, like in uh, uh, play now. And uh, let's look at the touchdown, man. Giles Jackson all the way. He got jammed up too. Well, let's look at it. He got jammed up too off the line right here. See, this defense is jamming my receivers pretty good right here. See, he got jammed right there. Let's take a look at it. He got pr jammed pretty good. See, he bumps him off his route, even though we still, we still have the inside position. That's the positive right here. Giles Jackson has the inside position right here. So he has this inside position. Okay. Now, you see my tight end is coming across right here. Okay. But I know Giles Jackson has more speed and he had more separation. Well, let's continue to play. Boom. We get great blocking. Let's look at it. Well, we didn't get great blocking. Giles Jackson, he just fast. I mean, Boston did make a, 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 a he did get a, he did get on the body right there. But then he just, Giles Jackson's speed, man, just, he just gets around that edge and he's gone. That's beautiful right there. He's gone, baby. He has gone to the house for a touchdown. Okay, now 
Let's go back and see what Giles Jackson's speed is real quick. Um, I was going to do that anyway, but let's go ahead and do that. Um, am I in the right part? Okay, let's go look at Giles Jackson, number five. Uh, wide receivers, Giles Jackson right there. His speed is a 93. That's pretty good. 94 acceleration because when I hit turbo, he just accelerated right past those guys, man. I mean, his agility, but his acceleration is 94. Pretty, pretty fast guy with the 93 speed. And he's an 81 overall, our number two wide receiver, guys. Yeah, yeah, he's a lot faster than our number one receiver right here. 88 speed. Now, Hunter, uh, Jeremiah Hunter is still a good receiver, man, but he's a deep threat. But, you know, we always, I got to make sure I look for Giles Jackson out here on the edge with that 93 speed. I'm Hollywood Sports. Thanks for watching, and I will see you on my next video.